Another uh, thing related to interface is one arm snipper. What is one arm snipper? As I told you, if you want to use your FortiGate firewall as an IDS, so just generate the report. By the way, we normally we use FortiGate analyzer. There is a log another application which we will discuss at the end. But anyway, we can use a FortiGate firewall as well. So whatever the traffic is coming, uh, it will one copy will go to the FortiGate firewall, just like a tape mode which we done in Palo Alto firewall. So for this purpose, we are using one arm snipper. So let's do it how we can do. So for this purpose, let me take one switch. Okay, and from here, let me take one web term as a client and uh, what I need to do, let me take a net cloud as better. Okay. So this is my internet. Okay. And let me 40 gate firewall. Okay. This is 40 gate firewall. And let me connect them to the uh, it's better to connect them to the net cloud. Yeah, this cloud. This is the management cloud. Okay. I will change it. So this is management. So I can take MGMT. Uh, right click on this one. Config. Show special interface. Choose loopback. In my case, I choose loopback. You can use any interface and loop back and connect it to here okay let me change this one to by the way it's better to on this one and do this rest of the thing and 0 slash 2 interfaces is connected to the switch 0 slash 0 interface we need these interfaces so uh, let me make them visible my PC is connected to 0 slash 1 okay and here 0 slash 2 is connected to the internet okay now what i need to do okay first i need to assign any ip for the management so management we are using uh, my loopback interface and my loopback interface ip is three range which we just use it if you remember 3.1 so I will assign 3.100 okay and let me on the switch as well and for PC let me stop it okay and right click go to edit configuration and enable DHCP this time because it's connected direct to this net cloud it will get automatically IP so no need to apply anything it will be make more easy otherwise you can assign a static ip as well by the way uh, that's it so let me check if this one is enabled first to this one so console otherwise we will configure switch first so let me see if ei yeah, is starting now so better to go to switch in the switch I need to configure a session you know the tape mode which we call them monitor you already done in Cisco switch so what I need to do in Cisco switch go to configuration and type uh, which we call them Monitor session one yeah, like monitor. that, sir. Yeah, I, remember. I forgot monitor. <laughs> yeah. So yeah. monitor session and one. Give them any number by the way, 66. And source interface. This is my source which I want to tap them. Interface E0 slash one. Both. Both direction means any traffic coming or outgoing. So this is the first command I type. Monitor session one. Uh, source interface is 0 slash 1 anything coming from PC in or out second I will say destination destination I want to push them to 40 gate firewall if 40 gate firewall is working like a IDS because it will not stop them anything if it is wrong or good so interface is 0 slash 0 that's it 
this was the only thing on Cisco switch show say show monitor sorry show monitor session one so this I configure okay so switch is done now go coming to 40 gate here we I just say monitor anything incoming outgoing and forward one copy to e0 slash 0 and e0 slash 0 I'm connected to the 40 gate firewall on port 2 but going to port 2 first I need to do something admin there is no password enter one two three one two three okay and config system interface which interface edit port 1 okay and set the mode static because it's DHCP by default it will not take IP statically and set IP 192.168.3.124 okay and everything is already allowed no need to allow suppose HTTP HTTPS uh, ping SSH telnet and end to finish this one show system interface question mark now I have 3.100 configure because this one this time my topologies change now let's hear and type and enter if everything is okay it will come up here admin one two three I don't need any more changes anything else just need to make port as a snipper That's it. Keep in mind this port is in monitoring mode in Cisco switch. We call them. If I check show interface uh, E0 slash 0 is showing down it in monitoring state. We call them monitoring state. It's used for monitoring this interface. It will be not used for any other traffic. So it will push whenever my PC1. Let me see my PC1 is working or not. First need to check. Can I go to Facebook? Yeah, it's his too. Because I get the IP automatically. This time I use DHCP. If you want to check, let me show you. If config, so 114.200. And I can reach to the internet. So my traffic is going directly. Yeah, I don't have any connection to the firewall. But you will see the traffic there. And this is what we call a snipper. So now let's go to 40 gate letter they say change the name I don't need to change the name the only thing I need to change is network go to interface and the interface which is connected port 2 to the switch this is the port 2 click on this port 2 and change to one arm snipper that's it and filter if you want to apply any filter like suppose any specific host traffic if you want to see but I say no just any traffic security profile if you want to enable that any antivirus web anything so you can use that one as well let me on we don't have any anyway in all session logs generate so that I can see the logs and okay Okay, now if we go back because it's like a one arm sniffer is mentioned here. Okay, no need to do anything. That's it. You see there is a capturing progress now showing. You can play them as well. If you want to capture the picket yourself, it will go to logs as well. But here they give you a capture as well. So let me generate some traffic. Go to Facebook and let me send some ping as well let me go to ping a dot a dot at google okay and now if you go here look at two person because some so what do you think something is coming when pc is going to internet they have no link here to come but basically when it's come to switch so there is a monitor session so we told them to generate send one copy to port two not port two zero but because it's connected here and we make port 2 as a snipper so anything coming on this port it will be snip and that's why it's recorded 6% let me stop this ping because it's a huge day sometime make them down and let me stop and download and open this in Wireshark directly SP 
PCAP Wireshark extension and you will see whatever their PC visit you will see here look at I use TCP then I use TLS then I because I went to Google and there will be ping as well ICMP packet look at ICMP packet because I was pinging 888 and this is my PC IP beside this uh, capturing when you go to logs and report there is a snipper traffic you will see those all traffic as well here it take time sometime it's not showing quickly but you will see after a while uh, sniffer traffic here is look at it say that the source was this time o2 ip was 114.200 which is my pc ip if i check if config 204 yes and it went to 88 for ping application name and then also use https browser send and receive traffic and every detail is mentioned here again you can download and you can see more detail you can earn more detail action you can see application category band channel date time family destination group mac address net net ip devices so many things of this traffic you can see from here so this is called a snipper and if you check here basically here you if i check wireshark so whenever pc1 is going so this switch is directing same copy here and monitor session one i told you you can say that only source only the uh, one way traffic you can do that one as well as well okay what else i need to tell you yeah that's it so this is snipper and we call them tap mode and we call them monitor mode and you can add it purpose but this uh, firewall is playing role of ids keep in mind sorry ids and this uh, sir can you show me one more time that uh, 40 gate what you did for port channel 2 nothing, for port 2 nothing i just went to interface okay keep in mind i changed nothing only went to interface the interface which is connected to the switch i click on the interface even no need of ip and just change the mode to one of snip that's it that's okay one. okay okay and uh, i mean i'm so i enable by the way security profile if you need otherwise no need and logs that i can see the logs that's it and the logs can only be see it cannot be seen from here the, that was for non but traffic so you will see nothing here so you don't need to be worried that the traffic is not coming for this special logs you have to come here and there is a snipper uh, traffic so you will see the snipper traffic here that's it this only one interface now you see a lot of traffic is coming so basically sir at ids ip side no, no need to do anything right yeah. if we connect ids also no this actually i'm doing like a ids work from 40 gate i just want to monitor and see the traffic not to stop okay, okay. otherwise there are so many things to stop the traffic in 40 gate but this 40 gate is not in line and line is our okay, switch okay. if i want to bring them in line and connect this one then i can stop everything but this time right sir right yeah so it's working like a ids and we done the same thing in uh follow all to firewall as well yeah so right right yeah so for audit purpose and monitoring purpose that's it okay so